Everyone, from grandparents to children alike, loves a good cartoon. It's Mrs. Crackenbush, our teacher! I'll teach you! I'll teach you! Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 memorable TV cartoon characters of the 1980s. Hawaiian cat flu. <laughs> well, I'm not worried. Garfield never gets sick. Hawaii. Yalai. John, did you hear me? For this list, we're looking at the cartoon characters that helped define the decade and are well remembered as being the best that animated TV had to offer in the 1980s. Watch and see what their delay has cost you. To be clear, we're counting both cartoons meant for children and for adults, so this list won't exclusively be filled with children's cartoon characters. Please, Inspector Gadget, couldn't we just sit here and wait? Nonsense! Inspector Gadget never waits! Number 10, Jem, also known as Jerrica Benton, Jem. Come on, come on and be a Jem girl, Jem! Jem is my name! The leader and singer of a rock band, and therefore protagonist of the show, Jem's life is similar to that of a superheroine's, and proves every bit as memorable. Showtime synergy! Let's hit the road! The alter ego of Starlight Music owner Jerrica Benton, Jem fronts the band Jem and the Holograms and is able to undergo this transformation thanks to her Gem Star earrings. Rio's coming this way any minute. We've got to get his attention. Synergy, we need help. In order to keep her identity a secret, Jerrica must use the power of Synergy, a computer with holographic abilities. Can you make a hologram of Jem that talks? Yes, it is a matter of projecting sound as well as image. Showtime, Synergy! As a result, Jem slash Jerrica's adventure is enticing, packed with action and drama, and filled with excitement, making this one of the most watched kids shows in the late 80s. You're the lowest of the low, Eric. Uh-oh. Run, Jem! Uh, run! Get her! Right! Number 9. Cobra Commander, the G.I. Joe, a real American hero franchise. G.I. Joe is completely disoriented. Their space shuttle will be mine! Mine! This popular show, based off the famous Hasbro toy line and Marvel comic book series, introduced many children to the excitement that is G.I. Joe. Our plan is working perfectly, and the poor simpletons don't even know it! While A Real American Hero features many memorable characters, Cobra Commander is perhaps the most unforgettable of them all, due to his purely evil intentions. And now, witness the final phase of Cobra's plan to stop the world! A humanoid with reptilian features, including a tongue he uses to snatch flies, this terrorist is the main enemy of the titular Joes. Surrender control of your nations to Cobra, or face the nightmarish prospect of a new dark age! Thanks to his great intelligence and physically terrifying presence, he's one animated supreme leader that's very hard to forget, as evidenced by his return in subsequent small and big screen adaptations of G.I. Joe. My scheme was even more brilliant than usual! The attack on the space shuttle was merely a diversion to mask our true purpose, the secret planting of a special cargo. Number 8. He-Man, also known as Prince Adam, He-Man and the Masters of the Universe. Ranger became the mighty Battle Cat, and I became He-Man, the most powerful man in the universe. Attempting to defend the citizens of Eternia and Castle Greyskull from another iconic character, the evil Skeletor, He-Man was a true cartoon hero. <laughs> For his brute strength and his blonde bob, E Man proved to be a real warrior with the help of his sword and his sidekick, Battle Cat. <laughs> Avoiding conflict when he can, He Man proved to be a noble and intelligent hero, but also one that could hold his own in battle. I've never dueled with myself before. If I can't defeat the shadow, maybe I can defeat what's causing it. Considered a true icon of masculinity in the 80s, at least in terms of cartoons, He-Man and his alter ego Prince Adam remain an animated classic. Wait a minute, there's water right under our feet. The underground river. 
All we have to do is try to get to it. The most powerful man in the universe also spawned another classic character with his twin sister, Adora slash She-Ra. Number 7. Inspector Gadget An inept but well-meaning police officer, Inspector Gadget was famous in the 80s and remains so to this day, battling the similarly memorable but also mysterious villain Dr. Claw. I wouldn't be so sure, Gadget. You can never tell what lies below the surface. Since he's a cyborg cop who possesses seemingly countless gadgets, you'd think he'd be the force's top police inspector. Go, go, Gadget phone! Hello, Chief. Dr. Claus heading for the airport. Keep on his tail, Gadget. We'll meet you there. But in fact, he's clumsy, inept, and just plain bad at his job. Now, where's that book that tells you what to do? It's always hilarious to watch him stumble around, but it's also equally exciting to see the many unique uses he finds for his gadgets. Go, go, Gadget Copter! No matter what Gadget's doing, it's always entertaining. How do you start these things? <laughs> Number 6. Scrooge McDuck, DuckTales Money is to be taken seriously. Didn't your Uncle Donald teach you anything? Though it wouldn't be the first appearance of Scrooge McDuck in the Disney franchise, DuckTales' version of the elderly Scottish duck featured a more family-friendly approach to the classic cartoon character. No, you deserve a reward. I know. I'll move you from the attic to, to the garage. <laughs> Named after Ebenezer Scrooge from Charles Dickens' famous novella, Scrooge's less-than-stellar personality traits seem to have been erased for this animated series, with him appearing happier and less irritable than in previous cartoons. The mind can play funny tricks on you. Especially a mind like yours. While his newfound heart allows him to be more approachable for children, Scrooge is also funny, noble, and moral, hating those who acquire wealth or power without earning it. Come out, you blasted bill collectors! Nothing scares Scrooge McDuck! He's a sentimental and smart character as well, making him the perfect father figure for his nephews and for the children watching the show. No, no, no! Come back, you chiseler! You'll never take my boys away from me! Never, never, never! Number five, Garfield, Garfield and Friends. Me? On TV? Well, it took them long enough to discover my natural talents. An adaptation of the beloved and popular comic strip, this show featured a Garfield that was as lovable and lazy as ever. People who sing like that should be drug out into the street and shot. He may be a fat and unmotivated orange cat, but he's also one that many people relate to on some level, either due to his cynicism, his laziness, or his intense love of food, specifically lasagna. Microwave lasagna and a TV set. What more could one want out of life? Though Garfield seems to hate on a lot of things, we know that he really does love Odie and Jean. And that's exactly why we love him so much. Garfield? Believe me, you didn't miss a thing. The rice was okay, but they forgot to cook the fish. He's hilarious, and his don't-care attitude speaks to us all somewhere, somehow. Here's a documentary on clipboards through the ages. Hey. Who says TV can't be educational? Number four, Michelangelo, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. You're no match for Michelangelo, master of the Manrique Gusari. One of the four popular anthropomorphic turtles named after Renaissance artists, Michelangelo gets the spotlight here due to his fun-loving attitude. Come on, Chrome Dome, hit me with your best shot. You bet I will. When not fighting villains Bebop and Rocksteady, Michelangelo is wielding his badass nunchucks, making jokes, or socializing with other characters, as well as exclaiming some of the series' famous catchphrases. Kawabunda! While not the smartest or most conniving of the turtles, he certainly is the most entertaining, and as such, the most fun to watch for kids and adults alike. We turtles don't know the meaning of the word defeat. That's right! We never bothered to look it up in the dictionary. Number three, Smurfette, the Smurfs. Dreamy! Oh no! <laughs> Are you out of your Smurf, Dreamy? That mean, terrible old Asriel nearly had you for lunch! We 
love all the Smurfs. However, the standout has gotta be the love interest of almost every one of these little blue dudes, as she's the only female on the show until the fifth season. Smurfette! Look how much firewood! Oops! Oh, clumsy! Help! As a female hero on an otherwise male-dominated show, Smurfette is portrayed as very ladylike, with long blonde hair, long eyelashes, and high heels. She provides some much-needed female perspective on the show. Oh, goody! There is nothing like a Smurf! Nothing in the world! Originally planted by villain Gargamel to sabotage the Smurfs, he eventually grew to be accepted as one of the family, thanks to Papa Smurf. That's what all good shows need! What's that, Papa Smurf? A happy ending! Smurfette thus proved to kids that good triumphs over evil, providing a great role model for young women everywhere. I must do something, but I'm not even a real Smurf yet. You'll Smurf what to do when the time comes, Smurfette. Number 2. Alvin, Alvin and the Chipmunks The lead vocalist of the Chipmunks, Alvin quickly grew to become the leader of the group, and eventually the fan favorite. What are we waiting for? We've got work to do! Always impulsive and charming, Alvin is the most charismatic of the Rodent Brothers, often leading them in hilarious schemes that he devised in order to get what he desires. I see the boys. They're in the attic, and they're putting Dave Watch in a big truck. But that won't stop the cheating. He's also the resident troublemaker, often causing wacky problems with other characters and bullying his brothers and human father figure Dave. Please, Dave! Well... Alvin! That's one of a kind! Be careful! Despite being the oldest sibling, he seems quite young at heart, and is therefore our favorite. Simon, how do you stop? Before we unveil our number one pick, here are some honorable mentions. Hey, Grumface! Next time there's a rainbow, look up! You'll feel better. Mercy? We'll be friends with you, if you'll be friends with us. I like Drizzle. It matches my personality. We will survive and create a mighty new empire. I, Lion-O, Lord of the Thundercats, proclaim it. Number 1. Optimus Prime, The Transformers Let's roll! Leader of the Autobots, this transforming sentient robot is unquestionably the best Transformer and one of the best cartoon characters of the decade. Save the war stories, hotshot. Just remember there's a thin line between being a hero and being a memory. While there were other great Transformers like Megatron and Bumblebee, Optimus Prime bested them all due to his strong leadership abilities, his compassion, and his bravery. You've lost, Prime! The Decepticons have won! <laughs> the race isn't over yet, Megatron. He's not only a great role model for children, but he also knows how to kick some serious butt, often providing the Transformers series with its greatest action sequences. You destroy everything you touch, Megatron! <laughs> He's badass, and more human than most actual human cartoon characters. And that's what earns him the top spot. But we're not fighters like they are, Prime! We must have courage, Huffer. We can't ignore the danger. We must conquer it. Do you agree with our list? What cartoon character from the 80s is your favorite? Short stack. For more exciting top 10s published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. Don't worry, I have the situation well in hand.